Good evening uh, for all the world with us. Dear music lovers, wherever you are, uh, we are excited and happy to perform a live concert from the beautiful auditorium of the Jerusalem Center for Near Eastern Studies, the Mormon University. As you can see, it's located in one of the most beautiful places in Israel, Jerusalem, in the world. And we are so delighted to play for you a very a happy music. To, uh, we will play music which start a new period, we hope, for the world. Uh, most of the, the pieces we will play will, will bring you joy, I hope, the spring spirit and love and uh, liveliness. Uh, we are Duo Lorenzen, uh, Eckhart Lorenzen, he, the violinist, uh, is the concertmaster from the Israeli Symphonic Orchestra. Uh, it's the Israeli Opera Orchestra. In the moment, they don't work, but we hope very much that very soon we, we go back to play. And I'm Batya Lorenzen Steinbock. I'm a pianist. We studied and we played all over, all over the world, mainly in Germany, Italy, Lithuania, Switzerland, Russia, Armenia, United States, and of course, Israel. And that's why we invited people from all these countries. I hope you all will be our audience today. So we will start with greeting you with Preludium and Allegro from Fritz Kreisler. And uh, it's like I said, it's before playing something to welcome you to the concert and then something very happy, the Allegro. Enjoy.
Van Beethoven's Spring Sonata. Uh, it has four movements, and we should say that it's a very European spring. All our friends now in Europe, Belgium, Germany, Italy, they know about what we speak. All over the other places in the world, we have another type of spring, but everywhere the spring brings new hope, new colors, Re, uh, new, new creations of things. And that's why we chose this sonata. Uh, it has four movements, as I had said. The first movement, uh, you could feel the wind and the rain and the sun and the, the clouds. You, you can feel how the spring wants to come, but still there is a fight between dramatic moments of uh, of winter till the spring winds. And then the second movement for our taste is like a flower who wants to go out of her earth to grow, to have leaves and to have beautiful flowers. From a very small seed, it grows up till it comes out and becomes very, very beautiful. And then Beethoven, even Beethoven, he wanted to make some jokes so he wrote a scherzo that we will dance and enjoy and uh, laugh. So if you hear that we don't play together, it meant to be so. Just look for it, if we play together or not, because it's a kind of a joke. And our best wishes with the fourth uh, movement, which is really a, a very hopeful wish for all the world, to have love, joy, a, a friendship, and only positive growing. And with this, we will play the fourth movement in the end.
So we are all glad, we hope, you too, that the spring came and love and freshness and flowers. And then we want you to feel after this period, it's our wish, uh, full thinking for you, uh, free, the freedom. That's why we chose to play a Zigeuner Weiser by Sarasate. This music give, gives us the sense of freedom, emotions, a free spirit. So from us to you, from the most beautiful place in Jerusalem.
Uh, before our last piece, uh, Salute the Mu, uh, I want first of all to thank all the people in the Mormon University. They were so kind and wonderful and professional. Thank you so much that you gave all of, of us in the world to have this possibility to share your love. And I want to thank, this is my youngest daughter, Eden. She's a pianist too, studies in Vienna. And she helped me very much with the pages. And I want to give this salute de mot to all of you, but especially for the people in Italy, all our friends and all the people in Italy and in New York where my oldest daughter, Maya, stayed all this quarantine time, all this corona time. And for all the people, stay safe and we want to give you a lot of love that you have power for the future. So I hope you got our love. It's for us a little bit strange to play with no audience, but I really assure you that we felt as if you are all with us. And it's quite a wonderful experience to know that we play not only for this hall, but for around the world. And we really want to give you another small present, also a contribute for all these American listeners that we have, that this is actually an American church, the Mormons church. So we will play something with you, which unites us a little bit. 
Von Borgen Bess, uh, George Gershwin, uh, it ain't necessarily so. Thank you. 